So this product basically uh, filters, fills, and helps to test the OCO3 payload. Um, we have a large accumulator inside that helps store excess fluid so that we can charge their whole payload um, with FC72 as the working fluid. Um, and then we they can basically run tests using this control system that we've set up for them. Um, and they can monitor the temperatures and flow rate and everything from this um, station. So you can kind of see um, we have the controller here which helps monitor and can record um, the temperatures, flow rates, pressures in the system. Um, we have several different control uh, valves and everything right here. So we have uh, gas and liquid pressures um, in the system. This is the outlet pump pressure. We have the back pressure relief valve, which acts as a uh, bypass valve for the system. So excess fluid that they don't want going through the payload goes through this line, which goes back around the um, suction side of the pump. The port here to take uh, fluid samples for particle testing so that they can control the cleanliness of the system, make just verify that it's meeting uh, their ISO 100A standard that need to meet. Um, and then we have a degasser on the side of the system, and these valves control the fluid uh, bypass or isolation to that unit. In order to de-aerate de the fluid, they run it through the degasser, and pull a vacuum on the opposite side of the degasser, which pulls the air out of the fluid as it runs through the degasser. Um, while all the liquid is being degassed, that's going to be on. But then once it's done being degassed, they'll shut these valves the way are, they are now and open this bypass valve, which bypasses the degasser and runs the system as it normally operates during testing. Typically, chillers don't have like, a degassing unit like the one that we have because they're not built for fluids like FC-72 uh, because it's such a special fluid that dissolves air so rapidly and it needs this special unit so that we can degas the whole, like all the fluid in the system before it actually runs uh, into their system.